you. All right. Cool. Yeah, we're good. Is it on now or just? Yeah, that's okay. on. All right. You guys ready? Yeah, let's do it. Sure. Here we go. Let's toss a point. This author wrote a work whose speaker has the image of Crassus weeping over the death of his pet lamprey stuck in his brain like a splinter. This author introduced the concept of pre-existence as the first of three planes of human life in a play where death introduces himself as Dionysus' cousin while trying to tempt Claudio. This author of the play Death and the Fool wrote about an English lord who suddenly loses the ability to use and understand... That's right, dude. Fine, buzz. Here's your bonus. Identify the following about Asian deserts for 10 points each. This large desert in northern China and southern Mongolia is bordered by the Altai Mountains. It contains the Alashan Plateau and the Dzungarian Basin. This desert in western China is bounded by the Kunlun, Pamir, and Tian Shan Mountains, and the Silk Road passes through it. That's right. This western Chinese lake in uh, Bayin Golin is located at the eastern edge of the Tarim Basin. It's better known as being the site of the first Chinese nuclear test in 1964 and many tests after that. I have no idea. Is this what the Siberian crane thing was that I don't know. Lake Chibin. Okay, it's Lop Lake. Okay. Um, you get 20 points, though. Top of two. One challenge to the prohibition stated in this legislation was led by James Saxon, and this legislation led to the Supreme Court case of Board of Governors v. Agnew. H. Parker Willis was an advisor to one of the men who proposed this legislation, and he claimed that it was already, outlawed, outda already outdated when it became law. This act was eventually passed after the findings of an investigation led by Ferdinand Pecora. One act with the same, of the same name as this act passed a year earlier. Uh, and try to counteract deflation by allowing paper currency to be given to the Federal Reserve. This legislation contains a section called Regulation Q that was the target of a Huey Long filibuster. Um, five. So, 34 Act, the Securities Act? No. Um, well, I'll prompt you. No, no. I will okay. not prompt you. I will protest. But okay. Protest. Your protest is noted. Um, <laughs> The Graham Leach Bliley Act repealed part of this okay. act in 1999 for 10 points, saying this 1933 legislation that created the FDIC and separated commercial banks and securities firms. Glass Steagall. That's right. Yeah, I'm I withdraw my protest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, bonus. The name for this genre is derived from a translation of the German term Ich Roman for 10 points each. Name this genre of confessional prose in Japanese literature used by authors like Na Naoya Shiga and Osamu Dazai, in which events closely correspond to episodes in the writer's life. What does that mean? I, I am. I am. I, uh, okay. Uh, Naoya Shiga. Uh, Jisuke Dazai. Yeah. That is not what I have. Okay. That's fine. It, I novel would have been acceptable, uh, or no. Shisho Setsu, or <laughs> Wataku Shisho Setsu. A late example of a popular I novel is this writer's tale about Suguru's encounter at a love hotel titled Scandal. A poor descendant of Napoleon Bonaparte named Gaston arrives in Tokyo in his novel Wonderful Fool. In this novel by Endo, the Jesuit priest Sebastiano Rodriguez arrives in Japan and is forced to trample on the image of a face of Christ. It's title refers to Rodriguez's inability to hear messages from God. You get 20. Toss up three. A theoretical prediction for the existence of this particle was made by Glashow and Bjorken in their work on SU4 symmetry, as well as by the GIM mechanism, which was postulated to solve the kaon lifetime problem. This particle more often undergoes decay into two kaons rather than three pions, even though the former branch is energetically disfavored, because in the latter case, the diagram can be cut by snipping only gluon lines, suppressing the three pion decay, and extending this particle's lifetime. Experimental setups used to discover this particle consisted of, elect of electron-positron collisions in one instance, and proton collisions with a beryllium target. Both experiments showed a 3.1 GeV resonance peak, which was interpreted as the bounce state of a particle with a mass of about 1.3 GeV and charge plus two thirds. Discovered independently by no. Discovered independently by Richter and Ting for 10 points, identify this meson, the first known bounce state of a charm quark and anti quark. Uh, that's right. What? No, I'm not going to turn it every time. We're going to have half, to, half the here, half there. Yeah, okay. Shut up. Fossil <laughs> 3. Answer the following relating to camouflage for 10 points each. These species contained primarily within the superfamily Majoidea, disgu Majoidea disguise themselves by attaching algae, anemones, and various other parts of the environment to their shells. This is awesome. Yeah, no. Yeah, hermit crab. 
No, it's called a decorator crab. Right, yeah. Decorator crabs use this technique in which of which camouflage is a form in which protection is conveyed by concealing of an organism from predators. Oh no, it's um. What is it? Answer. Eularian, but it's like this, this is this is called crypsis. Yeah, right. uh, crabs are a member of this order, which also includes shrimp and lobsters. Its name comes from the fact that members have five pairs of two legs. Answer. Defer to Maggie. Decapods. 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 Mariano Necrochea led a devastating cavalry charge during this battle. The night before this battle, the eventual losers had the chance to retreat into a stronger defensive position at Colina, but their commander rejected the plan and threatened to kill anyone who mentioned it again. Prior to this battle, one side had marched through the Los Patos Pass. Miguel Estanislao Soler got stuck behind a broken bridge during this battle. Field Marshal, Mar Field Marshal Marco del Pont was captured at this battle by the Talavera Regiment of Rafael Moroto. This clash was followed by the Second Battle of Canche Rayada and the Battle of Maipu, both of which were against Mariano Osorio. The winning battle, uh, the winning army at this battle, had crossed the Andes and was commanded by San Martin. Uh, that's four over here. That's right. So right. That was the right answer. That was the right answer. You're right. <laughs> you two are right. <laughs> this family's empire was established by Mayor Amschel, whose five sons formed the Five Arrows, or Five International Branches, for 10 points each, named this Jewish banking family a favorite of conspiracy theorists that came to European prominence in the early 19th century. Rothschilds. Yep. The Rothschilds got their start as bankers to the ruler of this German state. Mayor Rothschild's big break came when the English started paying the state money in exchange for mercenaries to fight in America. Yes. Yeah. This member of the Rothschild family was elected to the British House of Commons multiple times from eight, multiple times from 1847 onward, but was not seated because he refused to swear a Christian oath. The requirement was finally dropped in 1858, and he became the first practicing Jew to sit in Parliament. Daniel. 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 Lionel Rothschild. So you get 20 points. Toss of five coming up. Tossa. This character declare, declares, deciding not to be a bitch is what we have instead of a god, after calling another character to meet at the Hotel Montana. This character's fiancé insultingly calls another character a steer for following them to San Sebastian. At the end of the novel she appears in, her claim, uh, we could have had such a damn... Um, that's five over here. That's right. Right. <coughs> And a bonus for you, which I'm sure you will enjoy. This composer's piano pieces in C-sharp minor include the second of his Opus 64 waltzes and his fantasy impromptu for Napoli Teach, named his Polish composer in the Romantic Era, who invented the ballad and wrote 50 in Mazurkas. In the fourth of these pieces by Chopin in E minor, the right hand plays sine two note half steps to plays sine two note half steps, descents above a somber bass line. Chopin composed 24 of these pieces, which include ones named Hades and Chord. Yeah. Yes, uh, this A-flat major work by Chopin begins with ascending chromatic force in the right hand, separated by chords, and features a middle section with incredibly rapid continuous left-hand octaves, which represent galloping cavalry. Thirty. Toss-up six. Malcolm Arnold composed a grand, grand piece of this type, which is scored for orchestra, four rifles, a floor polisher, and three Hoover vacuums. These works originally were composed in contrasting French and Italian varieties, with the Italian version coming in fast, slow, fast movements as the predecessor of the symphony. One of these works, which was later expanded into a suite, depicts bottom braying after his head is transformed into a donkey's. Its concert type was later supplanted by the symphonic poem, and it includes a... You just want overtures? That's what I want. <laughs> That is the plot of Midsummer Night's Dream. Can you pause now? Here you go. He's mistakenly listed as dead after a battle, but returns home just as his wife dies in labor, giving birth to his son Nicholas for 10 points each. Named this prince, who's fatally wounded at the Battle of Borodino, but is sheltered in the house of his beloved Natasha Rostova, who stays with him while he dies. Andre. Yeah. At the end of War and Peace, Natasha Rostova marries this member of the Bezhenkov family, who kills Dol Dolokhov in a duel and attempts to assassinate Napoleon. No, Dolokhov survives. It's Pierre. Uh, okay. Yes, the, that's the correct answer. This rogue convinces Natasha Rostov to break her engagement and elope with him. Even though he's already married, his sister Helene becomes the first wife of Pierre. Anatole Karagin. Very good. 
30 points for you. Toss up seven. Robert Lynn's work with this man proved that under certain conditions, risky public projects should be evaluated solely based on their net expected benefit, since the social cost of the risk tends to zero. An analysis of land development under uncertainty is named after Claude Henry, Anthony Fisher, and this man, who concluded that the laissez-faire solution for medicine is intolerable in uncertainty and the welfare economics of medical care. Ken Ichinada extended one of this man's results concerning social welfare. Amartya Sen's liberal paradox builds off of the work of this man, whose most famous result is expanded upon in the Gibbert Saturn paper. Uh, <coughs> this figure is set to wield Verathranga, an Indo-Iranian concept which served prominent roles in both Zoroastrian and Vedic religions and translates roughly as the smiting of resistance for templates in each. Name this figure from Zoroastrianism who initiates the apocalypse called Frasho Kareti and revives the dead at the behest of the benevolent deity. He fights alongside the Amesha Spentas during Frasho Kareti. <laughs> That's right, dude. Saushan serves as the agent of this chief deity of Zoroastrianism, who opposes the evil uh, of Angra Mainu and will welcome all souls into the House of Song after the defeat of all evil at Frasho Kareti. According to Zoroastrian tradition, this figure was the first human being and a hermaphrodite. That's good, book. good knowledge. Good Saushan knowledge. Yeah, 30 points. Uh, toss bait. The presence of uh, Ramnogalacturanan II in this structure is thought to mark a major evolutionary shift. While Peter Albersheim investigated the biological impact of the presence of oligogalacturonans in this structure, the XPA, XPA and XPB genes code for excuse me, code for proteins uh, that reside in this structure, one of whose components is attacked by EPG. Xylo xyloglucan also plays a major role in this structure. It is made up partly of pectins, which are particularly prevalent in the middle lamella. The apoplast lies immediately inside of it. The struc this structure can make up a Casparian strip, and it's the location of expansion, which is influenced by oxen and mediates acid growth. These structures, which have been modeled using the diffuse layer model and the covalent crosslink model, also make up tracheids and often, and often are interrupted by plasmodesmata. Ten points identify these structures, secondary types of which contain a lot of lignin that make up xylem and are composed of um, two. No. And are composed of hemicellulose and cellulose. No. These are plant cell walls. Okay. We're all cool. We're all cool. Nope. Of nine. One essay concludes by claiming that this concept poses a problem between reconciling the internal view of self with the acknowledgement that we are parts of the world and accordingly do not have control over what we do. That essay cites ordinary city citizens in Nazi Germany who were subject to a test that citizens of other countries were not subject to as an example of the circumstantial category. Luck. More luck. Yes. Cool. Here's a bonus for you. Hemoglobin exhibits a sigmoidal affinity curve for oxygen for 10 points each. This means that hemoglobin cannot be studied using this equation from enzyme kinetics, which are in, uh, with which a reaction's rate may be found by dividing Vmax by its namesake constant plus the substrate concentration. The double reciprocal version of this equation can be used to generate a line weaver Burke plot. Yeah, uh, hemoglobin and other enzymes with sigmoidal affinity curves can be studied using this equation, whose namesake constant describes the cooperativity of binding. Answer? Yeah. Um, that's right. In this, in this effect, hemoglobin exhibits a lower carrying capacity as opposed to affinity for oxygen at low pH. It is especially pronounced in bony fishes. OK, that's the root effect. Um, you get 20 points and toss up, there's toss up 10. That's right, isn't it? Yeah. Did, Yep. Something go dead? Yeah, possibly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's we right. The, plants, the <laughs> plant cell wall. <laughs> okay. So here's toss of 10, uh, after which we'll have a score check. This poem's final stanza imagines small gnats mourning a white whaleful choir among the rivers. So it's too long. That was fast. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
Yeah, here's a bonus. Answer the following about people during the Qin Dynasty, for points each. This legalist prime minister of Qin Shi Huang uh, was responsible for many reforms and conspired to have his heir Fu Su commit suicide. Li Si. Mm -hmm. This chief eunuch of Shi Huang Di was Li Si's partner in legalism. However, he would outmaneuver Li Si and have him brutally executed. Maybe on fire. That's Zhao Gao. Li Si and Zhao Gao conspired to have this less than co less competent son of Shi Huang Di come to power. This man became the, the second Qin emperor. <coughs> Can you say, like, so, sorry. Can you say what? I don't know. Answer. It's Chin Er, er Shi. Er Shi is what we needed. So we get 10 points. Oh, yeah, second. Uh, all right. All right. 190 for Yale, 65 for Columbia. All right. all right. Okay. That's right. Focus is on you now. That's me. Focus. She'll have hair time for everyone else but me, because I was like, the focus of the first minute. Well, I mean, that's just the angle that we have. That's fine. Every, everybody's in the picture, except for you back there, because you're hiding. Uh, yeah. All right, here we go, Tosipalov. The lead up to this battle included the storming of a city known as the Geneva of the North, called Bolton. One commander in this battle became angered at the late arrival of, arrival of his rival, Lord Athan, whom he blamed for his imprisonment, imprisonment after the Battle of Volotho. One wing on the winning side was led by George Goring, and Lord Laven led a surprising attack during a thunderstorm during this battle. Many of a group called the Whitecoats under Newcastle died during this battle, which also saw a major defeat for Thomas Fairfax. The Scottish Covenanters played an integral role in this battle, which saw the first major defeat for Prince Rupert of the Rhine. This battle took place in North Yorkshire, and a parliamentarian defeat meant that the Royalists abandoned Northern England. For 10 points, um, Identify this victory for Oliver Cromwell in 1644. Uh, I think it's Maisie. You're wrong. Okay. <laughs> uh, identify this victory for Oliver Cromwell in 1644 during the English Civil War. That's right. That's, that's, that's the earlier one. Who's that? Fuck. Bonus. McGill professor Lydia White wrote a book about this concept's application to second language acquisition for 10 points each. In this theory, defended by Noam Chomsky, who analyzed the assumptions uh, children make during language acquisition process as evidence for innate principles shared by all languages. Like universal, 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 universal grammar. Sure. Yeah, universal, universal grammar. grammar. Yeah. Chomsky outlined his argument, uh, outlined, I'm sorry, this argument for universal grammar theory in Rules and Representations, which hold that there is not enough positive yeah, evidence for children to learn grammar solely from that experience. Yeah, already was. Mm -hmm. uh, Paul Smolensky and Alan Price proposed this theory that used grammars as ranking of as a ranking of constraints, which it maps with a system of inputs and outputs. Principles and parameters. No, I have optimality theory. Okay. okay. <laughs> I give you twenty points. <laughs> Class of twelve. One park in this nation protects the Iguala Lagoon and is called Loango National Park. And another park is home to the Congo Falls, Congo Falls, and is located in Ivindo National Park. This country's national park system was established in 2002 and set aside over 10% of this nation's total area. That system was developed in part by naturalist Mike Fay, who conducted the mega transect, taking photographs throughout this nation. The westernmost point in this nation is a cape home to the city of Port Gentile. The longest river in this nation is the Ogue, and the capital of this nation was founded by a group of slaves released from a Brazilian cargo ship. Ten points identify this country just south of the Bight of Biafra. That was the site of Albert Schweitzer's hospital in Lambarene, a former French colony with capital Libreville. Uh, five. No. That's no penalty. Sorry. Four. That's right. Stop translating. Stop translating. It was. Uh, yeah. All right. Here's your bonus. This event involved the SS Mont Blanc, a ship that was heavily laden with explosive material, which collided with the Emo and caused a tsunami in the harbor for 10 points each. Identify this event, the largest accidental explosion in history, which took place in the port city in 1917. Is that the Halifax? Yes. The Halifax explosion took place in this country, which also contains the ports of Charlottetown and St. John's. You think you, think you might know it? All right. Uh, this was the Prime Minister of Canada at the time of the Halifax explosion, and throughout World War I, he succeeded Wilfrid Laurier and was in office during the Winnipeg General Strike. Four. That's right, 30 Eight points. Uh, Toss-up, 13. One so far unsuccessful attempt of... Do uh, 
sorry, one so far unsuccessful method of doing this is to locate a periodic wobble that is proportional to radius, although this requires microarc second precision. The Doppler method for doing this relies on observing the periodic modulation of the semi-amplitude of the radial velocity. Uh, that's two. Yeah. Um, yeah. The first coconut tree supposedly came from a duel between two gods over this figure, in which each entered into the body of the other and attempted to kill his opponent from inside, resulting in the death of Tetuna for ten points each. And this Polynesian goddess, another version of whom appeared as a gourd to the surface of the water, as her husband Maui used his brothers to raise the Hawaiian islands from the water with a fish hook. That version distracted the male gods, preventing them from uniting the islands as one landmass. Who's that? Who's that? He does the mom. Haley's not related. Okay, so who's that? It's Hina. Uh, this other Hawaiian goddess represented fire, lightning, wind, and volcanoes, and lived in the caldera of Kilauea, born to Haumea. This uh, goddess was forced by her sister Namaka away from her homeland, leading her to find the navel of the world. Uh, Pele's sister Hiana uh, spent a lot of time in this part of Pele's body. It is also the part of Ymir's body that produced the first man and woman. Uh, it's not the armpit, because that's a giant, giant, giant armpit. Armpit? Yeah, that's right. Okay, cool. How much, did they, how much did they get on the previous bonus? Sorry. They got all three. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Plaza 14. The female lead of this opera examines herself in a mirror and considers whether she will become ugly white. <laughs> that is not what I have. Oh, man. That is not what I have. That was. That's true. I mean, it may also be true of that, but it's not what's written in here. And considers whether she will become ugly while singing uh, Di moi que je suis belle. One character in this opera is dressed in new clothes by the servants Probile and Myrtal, Myrtali or Myrtale, whatever, and angrily smashes a statue of Eros on the ground after learning of its origins. This opera was written by Sib uh, for Sybil Sanderson and begins with Palamon attempting to discourage its male lead from going to Alexandria, where he is introduced to the title character by his old friend Nikias. In the second act, the monk Athenael tries to convince the title character to give up her decadent ways, a decision the title character contemplates in an orchestral meditation. This op That's right. Here's a bonus. At the end of this poem, its speaker declares, We sing, but oh, the clay is vile, beneath our feet and long the mile, but let the world dream otherwise. For ten points each, name this poem, whose title object grins and lies, and hides our cheeks and shades our eyes. Its author included it in the poetry collections, lyrics of lowly life, and majors and minors. What? That's right. This late 19th century and 20th century African American poet wrote We Wear the Mask, an ode to Ethiopia, as well as many popular dialect poems. He asserted, I know why the caged bird sings in his poem Sympathy. This author included an homage to Dunbar in his poetry collection, American Journal. He wondered, what did I know, what did I know, of love's austere and lonely offices in a poem about his father waking up early to start a fire on a cold morning, those winter Sundays. Okay. That's Robert Hayden. <coughs> That's 20. Toss of 15. The history of Olaf Tryggvason names Jarl Sigvaldi of Skane, or Skane, as the son of this man's half-brother. As a result of his military failings, this man gave up his daughter with uh, Girid Olaf's daughter in marriage first to Girid's brother, Styrbjorn the Strong, and he later broke his promise to support Styrbjorn mil militarily by avoiding fighting at the Battle of Firisvalir uh, against Eric the Victorious. The end of this ruler's reign came when he was killed by the Yom's Viking uh, Palnatoki during his son's rebellion. And earlier, this king had betrayed Harald II Grey Cloak by helping his former enemy, Her Hakon Sigurdsson, to the throne of Norway. He moved his capital to Roskilde from the city from which his father, Gorm the Old, had ruled, and both men had erected. Uh, Bluetooth? That's right. Yay. Bonus for you. Her time living in the Ghost Ranch in New Mexico inspired her to produce paintings of the local landscape, including Ram's Head, White, Hollyhock, and Little Hills. For 10 points each, named this American painter, known for her depiction of cow skulls and close-ups of flowers, who was often photographed by her husband, Alfred Stieglitz. Okay. After meeting Stieglitz, O'Keefe became part of a circle of artists, including Arthur Dove, Mar Marston Hartley, and this modernist, who painted many abstract watercolors of New York and Maine. In 1948, a book magazine poll of artists and critics named him the greatest contemporary American artist. Well, that's fantastic. Uh, 
It's John Marin. Okay. This series by O'Keefe shows the title White Objects Tiling a Blue Sky with a pink horizon in the background. The fourth work in this series is the largest painting of the Art Institute of Chicago. Clouds, doves. Okay, why not? Clouds. Uh, no, it's above the clouds. Oh, sky above the clouds or just above the clouds. <coughs> or above clouds, <laughs> even. So you got uh, 10 points. Ten. Yeah. Toss up uh, 16. Along with her husband, this goddess ruled in the period before that of the nine, Aku. The 80th spell of the coffin text identifies this figure as the favorite child of the creator, who is instructed by the water goddess Nun to place this figure at his nose so that your heart may live after creating this goddess from Tefnut. Similarly, as the beloved daughter of Ra, this figure traveled with him in the solar bark and gave life to his nostrils. This goddess had a pair of wings with which she could revive the dead by beating the air around her, and she was often symbolized by a plinth. In this figure's most prominent role, 42 confessions were offered to her servants, after which this goddess sent a dead soul to Aru to live with Ra, or to be devoured by the monster Amit. That decision was made by weighing the soul uh, for Ma. That's right. <laughs> These functions are formed by multiplying the block wave function by a phase factor and then summing over all the resultant wave functions within the Brillouin zone. For 10 points each, identify this orthonormal set of wave functions useful in band theory. Yeah, for me. Harmonics. No, these are Wainier functions. The block functions from which the Wainier functions are constructed are solutions to a Hamiltonian with this type of potential, which has a characteristic repeating scale. A lattice is one example. Yeah. Periodic? That's right. Band theory is typically developed by considering the block weight solutions to this model, which approximates a lattice as an infinite series of square wells. Yes. So 20 points. Toss him. This artist used his friend Meyer DeHaan as the model for a devilish red-haired figure with a claw-like foot who looms over two naked girls on the left side of one canvas. This artist painted a self-portrait in which red and green apples dangling from a branch appear beside his, behind his disembodied head. This artist of Savage Tales painted a self-portrait subtitled Les Miserables and created the aforementioned self-portrait with Halo. He depicted a small out-of-perspective cow in the upper left of a painting diagonally divided by a bent tree trunk. He showed a creepy figure in a black robe staring at a sleeping nude woman in The Spirit of the Dead You Watch. Doesn't that just go back? Sure is. Okay. The Roman Empire faced many difficulties in their conquest of the Iberian Peninsula for 10 points each. During the Second Punic War, the Scipios were charged with keeping this brother of Hannibal from leaving Iberia and linking up with his brother's armies in Italy. He eventually broke out but died at the Metaurus yes. River. Uh -huh. Polybius called the long struggle with this leader of the Lusitanians the War of Fire for its violence. Wildly successful against Rome on the battlefield, he was killed in the sleep by three bribed Tartessian assassins. Uh, That's right. Uh, Wait, that's I said the, is that, the that is the correct answer. Sorry. <laughs> no, I said that's right. Okay. Uh, the final piece in the Iberian puzzle for Rome was the northwest was the northwest corner inhabited by Asturias and Cantabrians. They were not conquered until this man, Augustus's favorite general, pacified them in 19 BCE. So, like, what else would you like? Ipsanis Agrippa. Ipsanis Agrippa? Yeah. Good. 30 points. Okay, toss up next. When dealing with electron emission in metals, this equation replaces the Richardson equation. One equation derived from this equation involves the densities of ionization states in terms of the degeneracies, in terms of the degeneracy and energies of the states, and is named for the for Langmuir and Saha. By introducing a one over n factorial term to account for the indistinguishability of identical particles, this equation can be used to resolve the Gibbs paradox. This equation expresses energy as a function of only volume and entropy, which is proportional to the heat capacity raised to the two-thirds power and the thermal wavelength to the one-third power. It can be experimentally confirmed by raising the liquid from near absolute zero to boiling and adding the heat transfer required for this process to the entropy of vaporization. For 10 points, identify this double eponymous equation, which gives the entropy for a monatomic... Sacrotetrode. <laughs> get 10 points. And well-earned points. Yeah, okay. Here's your bonus. This work defines three types of anxiety, each of which was prominent in a different period in man's history. One anxiety, one ontic anxiety at the end of the ancient period, moral at the end of the medieval, and spiritual at the end of the modern. Each. Name this work whose titular concept consists of being oneself, participating in uniting that faith in a sort of God above God, the power of being itself. 
be and know what's going on. Why not? The Courage to Be? This German American Christian existentialist wrote The Courage to Be as well as a book that applies symbols of revelation to the type, to the problem of existentialism in a method of correlation, systematic theology. Tillage. Tillich's existentialism was strongly influenced by the, his interactions with this philosopher who explored the question of Dasein and his magnum opus being in time. Heidegger. There you go. That was good. What's that? I don't believe that Tillich and Heidegger were friends. He was a student. Like, he attended, like, Heidegger's lectures. I don't know if they were friends, but certainly, like, drinking oh. buddies. Um... Toss 19. Udagawa Kuni Yoshi's woodblock illustrations of this novel inspired a craze for full body tattooing. Translated into English by Sidney Shapiro, this novel includes a character who bashes a tiger to death with his bare hands, who appears in an episode that became the basis for The Plum in the Golden Vase. Like Outlaws in the Marsh? Yeah, sure. Yeah. 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 Not the best question ever. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, here's a bonus. <clears throat> this. This book begins with its narrator reading the title figure's religious novel, Hadrian the Seventh, only to discover pornographic letters written from Venice. For 10 points each. Name this book subtitled An Experiment in Biography by A.J.A. Simons about his search to piece together the life story of the crazy aesthete Frederick Rolfe. Yeah, I know that's about Frederick Rolfe, but I, I have no idea. It sounds delightful. What is this? It's called The Quest for Corvo. Frederick Rolfe claimed that the Duchess of Sforza Cesarini gave him the title of the Baron of Baron Corvo while writing a history of this Italian family, whose member Cesare inspired Machiavelli's The Prince. Or Georgia. In the quest for Corvo, Simons uh, chronicles how Rolfe uh, convinced editor Henry Harlan to publish stories to stories Toto told me in this literary magazine, a popular journal of aestheticism. Aubrey Beardsley serves as its art editor until being fired for the after the arrest of Oscar Wilde. That's uh, twenty points. And the last toss. <laughs> One ruler of this region murdered his brother at a feast to gain power as his son was being born, earning that son the nickname Bad Feast. A king of this region received the Golden Bull of Sicily, granting this region, a, region autonomy. According to legend, the capital city of this region was founded by the woman Libuse, while the native dynasty of this region traces itself to Primisil the Plowman. This region reached, its, uh, reached the heights of its power just before the Battle of Marchfeld, where its great king, Ottokar II, was defeated by... Bohemia. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Bohemia. 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 Here's a bonus. The merohedral variety of this phenomenon is exhibited by metazanurite, in which lattice formations are rotated relatively between separate crystals, while the cyclic variety results from non-parallel alignment when more than two crystals are involved for 10 points each. In this phenomenon that occurs when two different crystals grow into each other due to shared crystal lattice points. Yeah. It does. Like, Yeah, that's its name. Twenty. While, it's, while it usually exhibits Carlsba Carlsbad twinning, this type of feldspar, also called alkali feldspar, and contrasted with plagioclase, sometimes undergoes babino and manaback twinning. Moonstone is largely made up of this kind of feldspar. Is it ortho -clase? He said plagio. Okay, so ortho? ortho -clase. Yes. The, the cotrol bilby pole mechanism is a theory of crystal twinning in this type of lattice structure, which has a co coordination number of 8 and packing fraction about 0.68. That considered cubic. What else is there? Orthorhombic. Same one. No, it's body center key. So you got uh, 20 points. Okay, perfect match. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good I mean, I mean, that's a, that seems like it could be a plausible scene in many different contexts. So, I mean, the handshake is awkward, but like it's tradition. Yeah, I don't think I would have had the courage to buy it because I never heard of it as a mirror or a. They didn't say. They didn't 